Hello, this is Andy Ford with Andy Ford Video, and today we're going to learn about the loop out offset expression. Here I have a simple composition with this arrow graphic. I'm going to set two keyframes, one while it's off screen and one when it's randomly on screen, just for purposes of demonstration. And then I will alt click on Windows or option click on Mac, the stopwatch next to the position, and they'll add an expression. We will type loop out, that's with a lowercase l and a capital O and out, then parentheses, quotation marks, offset, and lowercase, end quotes and parentheses, semicolon. And now this is our loop out offset expression. And what this does is continue the motion of the arrow. So as you can see, instead of stopping at the last keyframe in the middle of the screen, it continues the motion at the same rate, but not reverting back to the original start value. As you can see, if I drift the keyframe further apart or closer, I will change the rate of speed that this happens. Perhaps I can better demonstrate the power of the loop out offset expression by adding another keyframe and altering the movement of the arrow. So now I have the arrow doing this little swoop. And you can see that with this expression, it will continue doing the same motion across the screen. So hopefully you can see how helpful this expression can be with just limited keyframes. It's great to start a loop at the same spot where the motion ended. So have fun with this expression. Thank you.